Around the world, vaccines have saved countless lives. Smallpox, polio, measles, diphtheria, the list of diseases managed is long, but the number of cases prevented is in the billions. Vaccines are complex drugs, and therefore many of them need to be kept refrigerated to be effective at the point of use. So how do these vaccines get safely delivered around the world, even to rural areas in hot climates, all while remaining in peak condition? The answer lies in the cold chain. These temperature-controlled supply chains allow essential items to be transported and maintained at specific temperature ranges. This cold chain relies on F gases to keep stable and effective. Depending on the vaccine type, this means chilling the product to a constant temperature, often 2 to 8 degrees centigrade, but sometimes right down to minus 70 degrees, colder than the coldest place on Earth. These cold chains rely on F gases, which are safe to use due to their low flammability and toxicity. A typical journey might include transport by planes, trucks, cars, and in more remote areas, motorbikes or bicycles. The insulation in vaccine carriers also requires the use of F gases as foam blowing agents. Yet despite advances in refrigeration, huge challenges remain. The World Health Organization estimates that up to 50% of vaccines are wasted globally every year, largely due to the lack of temperature control and the logistics to support an unbroken cold chain. And children continue to fall ill and die from very preventable diseases. F gases are an essential part of vaccine programs' safety and effectiveness. Can we afford to live without them?